everyone welcome back to our channel anshruta's world in this video we are going to learn about the current affairs for the month march 2023 this is a new series that we have initiated this video will cover all the major events that have happened across the globe in a month so without further ado let's get started National News India currently presided over the second environment climate sustainability working group meeting of G20 on 27 March 2023 The 3 day meeting was held in Gandhinagar Gujarat with the participation of 130 delegates from G20 member countries The meeting emphasizes the importance of water resources management in the context of climate change. A half marathon was conducted on Pongmung Lake in Ladakh which was registered in Guinness Book of World Records as the world's highest frozen lake half marathon. The 4 hour and 21.9 km Half marathon took place at the height of 13000 feet in sub zero temperature it was organized to raise awareness about melting of himalayan glaciers due to climate change the indira gandhi tulip garden situated in srinagar of jammu and kashmir is asia's largest tulip garden The garden was opened to the public on 19 March 2023. The President of India, Shrimati Draupadi Murmu, presented six Padma Vibhushan, nine Padma Bhushan, and 91 Padma Sri awards for the year 2023 at Rashtrapati Bhavan on 22nd March 2023. Provident Padma Award winners are Zakir Hussain, S M Krishna, Srinivas Varadhan, Mulayam Singh Yadav, Kumar Mangalam Birla, Sudha Murthy, Vani Jaira, Kapil Kapoor, Ravina Tandon, Guru Charan Singh. Asia's first woman loco pilot Surekha Yadav has become the first woman to operate the newly introduced semi-high speed Vande Bharat Express train. The world's largest platform is being built at Hubli station in Karnataka. Do you know currently Gorakhpur railway station has largest platform in India and the world? Newly elected chief ministers of states Conrad Sangma, Meghalaya, Manik Saha, Tripura, Nephew Rio Nagaland Group captain Salija Dhabi has become the first woman officer in the Indian Air Force to command a fighter unit. She will command a missile called drone in western sector. Dhabi was commissioned as a helicopter pilot in the Indian Air Force in 2003 and has over 2800 hours. of flying experience The world's highest railway bridge Chandam bridge is being built over the Chandam river in the Indian state of Jammu and Kashmir It will be 359 meters high and 1.3 kilometers long Mr Ramesh Bais became the new governor of Maharashtra He has also served as the Governor of Jharkhand and Tripura, Mr. Anthony Albanese, the Prime Minister of Australia, has visited India from 8 to 11 March 2023. International News: Newly elected presidents of countries: Xi Jinping, China; Bola Tinubu. Nigeria Ram Chandra Podel Nepal Mohan Thog 
वियतनाम अजय पाल सिंह बक्का एन इंडियन बॉर्न अमेरिकन बिजनेस एग्जीक्यूटिव हैज बीन नॉमिनेटेड एज प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ वर्ल्ड बैंक बाय यूएस प्रेसिडेंट जो बिडन एरिक माइकल गार्सिटी एन अमेरिकन पॉलिटिशियन एंड डिप्लोमेट हैज बीन नॉमिनेटेड एज यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स एंबेसडर टू इंडिया ऑन 24 मार्च 2023 Mira Murati has been appointed as the Chief Technology Officer at OpenAI, the American artificial intelligence research company that developed ChatGPT. Apsara Iyer, an Indian-American student from Harvard Law School, USA, has been elected as the president of Harvard Law Review. She is the first South Asian woman to be elected to the position. A cat named Piper from Virginia, USA, which had gone missing for 9 years, was reunited with its owner. A person found the cat and informed animal protection officers, who tracked the owner with the help of a microchip on Piper. A Pacific pocket mouse named Pat set a Guinness World Record for being the oldest mouse in the world at the age of 9 years and 209 days. The mouse was born in 2013 and lives in San Diego Zoo Safari Park, USA. Art and Culture The 95th Oscar Award ceremony was held in Los Angeles. India's Datu Datu song from SS Rajamouli's film RRR created history by becoming the first Indian film to win the Oscar for being best original song. The Elephant Whisperers, another Indian entry at Academy Awards, also won an Oscar in being best documentary short film category. The short film explores the bond between Raghu, an orphan baby elephant, and his caretakers. Michelle Yeoh, 60-year-old Malaysian actress, became the first Asian woman to win the Best Actress Award in Oscar Reward Ceremony. Yeoh won the award for the film Everything Everywhere All at Once. Satish Kaushik, a famous Indian actor and director, passed away on March 9 in Delhi at the age of 66. He is famous for his comedy roles and has acted in popular films like Mr. India, Surma, and Uttar Pradesh. Science news. Scientists have found unusual and mysterious sand dunes on Mars, which are almost perfectly circular. The sand dunes are captured by the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter while observing the disappearance of frost at the end of winter on Mars. Scientists at University of Sheffield have discovered a new ring system around a planet called Quar. Quar is a dwarf planet. that circles the sun beyond neptune this is a earth imaging satellite is a joint mission between nasa and isro it was handed over to isro at bengaluru by nasa on 8th march this is will provide scientists information on climate change natural disasters and crop growth DSR is expected to be launched in 2024. Asia's largest 4-meter liquid mirror telescope was launched on 21st March in Uttarakhand. It will help scientists to gather more information about the deep sky and things from asteroid to supernova.
ISRO's LVM-3 M3 rocket with 36 satellites was launched successfully on 26th March from Triharikota, India as a part of One Web India mission. NASA has unveiled a new generation of spacesuits for humanity's return journey to moon. The new design of the spacesuit comes with the special features to help astronauts conduct scientific experiments on the lunar surface. Scientists at Tel Aviv University in Israel have developed a robot that uses the antenna of locusts to detect different odors. Australian scientists have discovered an enzyme called HUC that has the ability to change air into energy. The enzyme is found in soil and can produce an electric current by using hydrogen from the atmosphere. An electronic bandage has been innovated by scientists at Northwestern University, USA. Bandage that speeds healing by 30%. The e-bandage can heal wounds by delivering electropathy right to the wound site. This will be beneficial for the people who suffer from diabetes. Adenovirus cases are on the rise in West Bengal. The virus mostly affects the respiratory system of our body. There are no vaccine against the virus. People have been instructed to wash their hand using soap, avoid touching face, eye without washing hands and consume home cooked food. Scientists recently found the fossil of a 185 million year old crocodile on Jurassic Coast in Dorset, UK. The creature has been named Turdus such as Higlier and length is about 2 meter. Scientists at the Indian Institute of Technology, IIT, Guwahati have developed a type of protein that can transform a human's healthy skin cells into heart cells. Researchers at IIT, Turkey have innovated wall tiles by making use of waste polythene used to make plastic bags. Scientists have discovered the pollen-covered fossils of insects called Tiliardemids, which is 280 million years old. Scientists believe this could be the first plant pollinators in the world. Sports News Nikhat Zareed won gold medal in 2023 World Women's Boxing Championships held in New Delhi. Lovelina Borgohead won gold medal in 2023 World Women's Boxing Championships held in New Delhi. Akshdeep Singh won gold medal in Asian 20 km race walking championships 2023 held in Japan. Rohan Bopanda became oldest tennis player to win the ATP Master 1000 title held in California. India has won both the women's and men's titles of the Asian Kho Championship held at Tabulpur, Assam. India won the 2023 Border Gavaskar Trophy in cricket by defeating Australia 2-1. Economy News The Reserve Bank of India has launched the mission Her Payment Digital to promote digital payments in India on 6th March 2023. The Reserve Bank Governor Shiktikant Das has received the Governor of the Year 2023 award by international publication Central Banking. Earlier, Raghuram Rajan, the former RBI Governor, had received the award in 2015. Mr. K. Krithivasan has been appointed as the new CEO of TCS, India's largest IT company. According to the latest Global 500 2023 report released by Brand Finance, 
Jio has emerged as the strongest brand in India and is ranked ninth among the 25 strongest brands in the world. Campacola, a soft drink that was available in 1970s, will be relaunched in India by the Reliance Group. The drink will be available in three flavors at price lower than Pepsi and Coca-Cola. India has been ranked as the world's eighth most polluted country in 2022. The top six polluted cities in India are Mumbai, Delhi, Kolkata, Hyderabad, Bengaluru, and Chennai. Important days: 8th March, International Women's Day. 20th March. International Day of Happiness 21st March International Day of Forests 22nd March World Water Day 23rd March Martis Day 오피라이크 디스 비디오 Don't forget to subscribe to my channel Bye